Good morning, Supervisors. My name is Mike Rudyman. I'm the Vice President of the Tucson Metro Chamber. Thank you very much for your time. I do want to start off by saying that the Chamber very much appreciates the ongoing partnership with Pima County. Uh, we are uh, doing a lot of workforce development programs with Pima County, particularly the One Stop organization, working with a lot of employers, making sure that we're providing the right kind of training programs for those employees. Uh, we are working with your health department as well as the sheriff's department on implementing potential tools for businesses and companies uh, that can help fight the opioid epidemic, uh, something that uh, is obviously a huge concern in this community. Uh, we are also uh, very happy and have been very pleased uh, with the county's efforts recently as it relates to economic development. Uh, we think that uh, the work that uh, Mr. Huckleberry and the board has done working with companies uh, to uh, help them transition uh, and come to this uh, community uh, is, is certainly should be applauded. Uh, but as it relates to economic development, uh, this resolution that you have in front of you opposing the Rose Online is, is just something that the Chamber simply cannot support. So I'd like to read um, a portion of the editorial that our President and CEO, Amber Smith, uh, penned uh, and showed up in the, in the uh, Arizona Daily Star last year. Arizona is a mining state. To this day, Arizona mining companies produce 65% of the copper in the United States. This history of mining in our region runs deep, most prominently when Tombstone was the largest city between New Orleans and San Francisco soon after Ed Shefflin struck silver in the late 1870s. The Tucson Metro Chamber has a long-standing position in support of the Rosemont Project, but it's more than just supporting a company trying to operate and ultimately hire over 400 people, adding to the growth for our local economy. It's also in support of the industry. Mining is in Tucson's blood. New technologies are being developed, and much of that development is here in Tucson. For close to 40 years, Modular Mining has produced products designed to improve safety at the mine site. Hexagon Mining, with operations across the globe but headquartered in Tucson, creates programs that more efficiently plan the overall operation of mine sites. Caterpillar, which relocated its service mining and technology division to Tucson in 2016, is on the cutting edge of developing technology that operates mining equipment uh, autonomously. These companies are here because Arizona is where the action is. The customers are down the road in Green Valley, Sawadita, Parenti, to name a few. They're also here because of the talent that exists in our region. Those talented individuals are attracted to Tucson because of the opportunities in the aforementioned companies, but talent is also developed locally at high school and university levels. From excavating the earth to providing the talent and resources our region's investment in history and mining is significant. The Tucson Metro Chamber is proud to support Rosemont in its efforts to start production uh, since federal approval has been granted. More than 10 years of back and forth is enough. It's time to move forward with our proud mining legacy. Thank you.